This is Agaja Beach under serious erosion threat. The beach was not like this 12 years ago until this wrecked ship was abandoned. We gathered that the coastline was one kilometer into the ocean before the erosion started. This means those who settled at that stretch had been displaced. We also got information about these rather strange gigantic wells. Certainly, no one will build a well like this for domestic use. And this is one of the many causes the erosion by the wreck has inflicted on this community. The coastal bed is between the lagoon and the ocean. And according to Alade Adeleke of the Nigerian Conservation Foundation, if nothing is done soon enough, there could be collision. An Agaja community would be history. To avoid the problems of ecological uh, coastal erosion that is happening on the beach here, um, it's also necessary to save people's lives and property and to restore the integrity of the shoreline of the Agaja Beach. In a couple of weeks, this community can start breathing a sigh of relief. We are so pleased with the government on this development. It is hoped that when this shipwreck is removed, it will enable the equal spread of the sand along the coast to avoid further erosion. Agaja Beach is not the only place threatened by erosion. As we sail along, there are wrecks by the coast, and they've been for decades. According to international standards, wrecks are alien to the coast. Critics wonder what the Nigerian Maritime Administration and Safety Agency has been doing in checking the menace. Vivian Irikefi, STV News.